guys, how are you? Mike here from Mondays with Mike. Thank you so very much for joining me on uh, Mondays with Mike, another episode. I always appreciate you guys being here, so thank you so much for, for joining me. Um, let's go ahead and dive into this week's message, and it's a, it's a very important one, and it's why is it that um, weight loss strategies, call them what you will, plans, courses, whatever it may be, why is it that majority of them do not work? Why is it that less than 2% of all people who try to lose weight, who try to diet, who try to um, you know, be healthier and eat healthier and, and lose whatever it may be, 20, 30, 50 pounds, why is it that less than 2% are successful in doing that? Um, really, when it comes down to it, why is it that plans, weight loss plans just flat out do not work? And let's talk about that. Why is that? Because, I mean, information is it's it's endless, right? I mean, we can go online, Google weight loss. You're gonna find I don't know hundreds upon hundreds of different plans. So it's not that we don't have access to, to you know plans and and a lot of the stuff's actually free. So the content is actually out there um, as far as how to what to do to lose weight, how to do it, what to do, etc. So if that's the case, what is the deal? What's the issue? And let's talk about that. The reason why weight loss plans do not work is because a weight loss plan is a strategy. A weight loss plan is a strategy to get you to lose the weight. But we, we're starting at a strategy from a strategy perspective, which we never even took into account our mindset, where, where we are mindset-wise, because that becomes the most important thing. Before the strategy works, before we can take full advantage of that strategy, we got to make sure we're in the right mindset. So there's three things that we need to do, and strategy is definitely one of them, but it's number three in line. There's two things that come before picking the strategy, picking the plan you're going to use to lose weight. There's two things we need to make sure that is right before we actually use this plan, the strategy, number three, to lose the weight. What is number one? Number one is state. You have to be in the state of mind. Change your state to believe that you can lose the weight. So I don't know about you guys, but whenever I'm just kind of down and out, laying on the sofa, I'm feeling pretty terrible. Like, oh man, I don't, I don't want to do this. I can't do this. And the state I'm in is just one of, I don't want to do it. I can't do it. I'm not going to do it. That is my state. And if that's the state we're in, I don't care what plan we put in front of us. It's just not going to work. We're not in that good state of mind. So we have to change our state. The way we change our state, guys, is by literally moving. You know, motion affects emotion. Motion affects our emotion. So it's just moving. That's why some, sometimes you'll even hear, jump in a cold shower for 5, 10 minutes. Change your state. I mean, that shock, that little zinger to the body, that changes your state. Whole different ball game. You go from laying on the sofa, not wanting to do anything, to taking a cold shower for 5 minutes. That'll change your state. Whether it's a cold shower, whether it's going for a walk for 10, 15 minutes, whether it's doing 20 burpees, change your state. That is number one. Change your state before picking your plan, which is number three, your strategy. Number two is we have to change our story. Once we change our state, we get ourselves up, we give ourselves a little zinger with a cold shower, with 20 burpees, with that three mile run, whatever it may be, we completely start thinking differently. All of a sudden, the things we didn't think we, didn't think we could do, oh, I can't do that, I don't even know where to begin. Our story, our mindset starts to change from, oh, I don't think I can do that, to I can definitely do that. I don't know what to do, to I can definitely do that. I know what to do. It goes from like, I, I just, I give up. I failed before, I'm gonna fail again. It goes from that story to like, yeah, I failed before, but it's not going to happen this time. That happens when we change our number one, our state. Number two, when we, once we change our state, we start to change our, our mindset. We start to change our mindset, which is number two, our story. So if you want to keep it easy, state number one, number two, story. We begin to change our story. And then, then, only then, only then when we have done those first two, number one, change your state, number two, change your story, only then will number three your strategy, the strategy that you pick to lose your weight, only then will that strategy work for us. You know, we always start with just going after the strategy and then we wonder why it doesn't work and oh my God, I've tried five, six different ways, I just, I just can't do it. Yeah, we can't do it because it doesn't start with strategy. To recap, start with changing your state first. If you're down the dumps, you're in a, in a, in a, in a rut, you just don't know what to do, change your state, zing yourself, take that cold shower, do those 20 burpees, go for a run, do whatever's gonna get you out of that state that you're currently in. Whatever, may, whatever it has to be to change that state. Number two, once you do that, change your story to, oh, I can't, I don't know what to do, to yes, I can, and what can I do? Forget, I, I don't know what to do. Ask yourself, what can you do? And that'll come naturally once you change your state. 
That's number two, change your story. Number two, change your story. Number three is pick your strategy. Okay, pick your strategy. And if you need help picking your strategy, reach out to me. I'm more than happy to help in any way I can, guys. I provide plenty of strategies on the wellness bucket, but I'm, I'd be... I'd be lying if I said there's not a ton of other great strategies out there as well that might work better for you than the ones I offer. Regardless, I want you healthy. I want you awesome to the best, doing the best you can be, being the best you can for yourself, for those around you, and for the world in general. So that's this week's message, guys. I hope it helps. I hope it resonates. Um, if I can help, like I said, in any, in any way at all, reach out to me. It's Mike at thewellnessbucket.com. Thanks for being here, guys. Have a phenomenal week ahead. And until next Monday, cheers.